There are two common approaches to counter forensic investigation of an allegedly malicious mobile application. There is the static analysis and the dynamic analysis. The static analysis consists of reviewing the APK file without inspecting the actual instructions. This type of analysis can verify whether the data is malicious, present information about its functionality, and sometimes give information allowing us to create some uncomplicated network signature. This kind of analysis, however, this kind of analysis is not effective against complex malware, as it can skip some of its behavior. As for the dynamic analysis, the main methods of dynamic analysis include launching. As for dynamic analysis, the main methods include launching the APK file or launching the application and monitoring its behavior in the system to remove the infection. However, before running the malware safely, you must make sure to run it in a lab environment to minimize the harmful effect. You can use the techniques of dynamic analysis without having an in-depth programming knowledge such as Java. But again, this kind of technique is not useful for all the malicious program as it can skip some functionality. So the best way is to combine static and dynamic analysis techniques.